Hey man, you guys, a quick video on the five must-have applications for your Mac. Now, the first one I'm going to go over is called Jump Cut. This runs in your menu bar, and basically what it does is it copies everything that you do um, when it comes to copy and pasting stuff. So if I'm going to go to Safari and I go to YouTube, or I go anywhere, um, and I want to copy something, let's say I want to copy this, for some random reason I want to copy it. So I copy it, and then I want to paste it somewhere, but I don't want to leave. I also want to copy the title, and I also want to copy, um, let's see, I also want to copy this. So I'm just constantly copying copying everything, um, and what Jump Cut does is it stores all of these inside here. So um, if I, now if I push the command, whatever command I set it up to, you can go to preferences and set up your commands. Mine is alt, command, and V, it'll show me this over here. And as you can see, I can go back and forth between all my copies that I did, and I can paste it wherever I want. So if I go to a program, for example, stickies, and I make a new sticky, I can push command alt V, choose whichever one I want, and then paste it. So this works with anything, um, and also it pastes it um, just like you would type it. It doesn't have its um, font changed or anything like that like this. So it doesn't have the back the background changed or anything like that. So it's a lot easier to just copy and paste um, like that. Definitely um, I use this, pro this program every single day. A must have in my opinion. Um, number five out of four in terms of having it, the need of having it. The I have number one as the most needed. You have to, absolutely have to have that program. You don't absolutely have to have this program, but I think it's a very useful program and you'll like it a lot. The next one that I had that I want to show you was, let me make sure, Better Touch Tool. Now I have, uh, I think, two videos on this on, I used to have two, I think I only have one now. A video of this on YouTube as well, on my account. You can check it out right here, on this little section right over here, as you guys can see. And um, what that does is basically, um, you can do a bunch of more gestures, um, like closing windows just by double tapping something else. I didn't use my keyboard on that, by the way, I used my... A trackpad. So um, you, this works with a magic mouse. You can do stuff with your keyboards. You can do um, a lot of cool stuff. You can do window snapping. It's just a really awesome program. I use it a lot, especially for everything. I can spaces with four fingers to the right. There's a lot of things that you can normally not do on a regular MacBook. It just basically, it's your trackpad or magic mouse on steroids. I definitely highly recommend getting this program. It's free. Um, all the programs I'm showing you guys today are going to be free. So, um, Definitely recommend getting Better Touch Tool. Watch the video if you want to um, learn more about Better Touch Tool. The next one that I had was called um, Alfred. Now, I just made a video on this really recently. Um, basically, what it is is if I push either Alt or Space or Command or Space, I changed it to Command Space because I don't use Spotlight as much anymore. Um, it's basically Spotlight on steroids. <laughs> so, basically, what you can do is you can search websites, you can search. Um, Search queries in the website. For example, if I type U, uh, Y, type T dot in, it'll go to my YouTube account channel, and um, I can just search out something on my web, on my YouTube account. So that's something that's pretty cool. Another cool thing that you can do is you can um, search. Basically, with your search query, you can do anything. You can just type in Safari, and it'll show Safari. It shows the seven things that you want to search. So um, this is a really cool program. It's basically Spotlight. You can do everything Spotlight can do and more. So um, even adding and subtracting and whatever. So um, doing dictionary, all that stuff. So I definitely recommend getting this program. Um, definitely get Alfred too. That's a big time must have as well. The next program, by the way, I'm using camouflage to show my apps uh, closing and disappearing and not disappearing. So that's that. Just letting you know. It's called camouflage. This one is called the unarchiver. Now, by its name, you can figure out what it does. It basically unarchives files. For example, if I have a zip file or a 7z file or a rar file, this thing will do everything. It's basically the WinRAR for Mac. So um, and it's free. So what you can do is you can just get that and you can unzip any file, like literally any file. You won't have any problems unzipping files anymore. This thing is a beast when it comes to unzipping files. Uh, definitely recommend downloading that if you're planning on downloading a lot of stuff, especially if it has different files names, like 7z, rar, or um, just a bunch of different random stuff. So that's definitely that one. 
the uh, next the first the number one application that you must have this is a necessity you have if you don't have this download it right now this is a necessity you have to have on all MacBooks or else you will be wasting a lot of space on your computer and it'll just make your computer really slow and you don't want that it's called app cleaner now what this does is basically uninstalls your programs Apple did not give you an uninstaller for your programs when you first buy your computer. You have to, when you uninstall a program, for example, I want to un uninstall Tube TV. So I drag it over here, and as you can see, it has a Tube TV folder, this Tube TV.plist, whatever this is, and then the application. What Apple would want you to do when it says uninstall program is just drag and drop it to your trash can. Now, what that would do is it would leave behind the extra two, two files that we had over there. But you see, we don't want to do that. We want to keep it so that it doesn't leave it behind. Um, so that's definitely something you want to have so that you don't just throw random stuff away without finding the other files that are related to it. This is a big time must-have, and I definitely recommend you download it right now. So these are my five must-have applications that I definitely recommend that you download all of them. It'll make your life a lot easier and make your computer life a lot funner as well. Um, and your productivity will skyrocket by using these applications. Um, so just go ahead and download them. You can find some of them on the App Store, some of them MacUpdate.com. Um, I'm sure you can find all of these at MacUp at MacUpdate.com. I'll give you the link in the description for all the up for all the downloads. Just recommend getting this to everybody. Um, go ahead and download it, guys. So it's T Dottian, and um, comment if you guys have any questions, uh, concerns, whatever you guys want to ask me. If you guys need help with any of the programs, just go ahead and ask me, and I'll answer them. So that's about it, guys. Uh, see you guys later, and goodbye.